Friday. Yeah. A she fox. Are you here, bro? Dude. Oh well. It's just me. What's up, chat? Welcome back, everybody, to some more Sea of Thieves. Big favorite here on the channel. Always cool to uh, play this with our friends. Jerry time? Well, me and SheFox are here. Uh, Jerry, if you're watching, you're welcome to join. Uh, Booster, I guess. I don't... I, I guess anybody's welcome to join who's from the goof troop. <clears throat> Although, I prefer to try to maybe possibly keep it to three people so we can do a Brizantine today. As Bradford calls it, the Byzantine Empire. What are you doing? Well, uh, she Fox joined us for the first time last time in this game and had a lot of fun. And we uh, played with Uthras, who kind of jumped in randomly. We kind of did like a, your typical old, like, dig up buried treasure. And then Uthras joined, and then we went for a vault and had a very successful run. And um, it was really cool. And I was happy to do it, so... Now we're back for more. She liked it. I enjoyed it. I want to do more. And it's always cool to teach new people uh, a game, even if you're not that great at it. Just showing people the concepts. Oftentimes I find out that my friends are very quick to learn new games. I'm pretty quick too, but... Yeah, they're even better than me. And that's cool. Show people the ropes and then they uh, take it a mile, which is nice. Muy bueno. See? Gray Fox. No, that's that's me, ladies. That's me. 
Uh, thanks again, guys, for all the big O gift bombs today. Thank you very much for all the memberships. Thanks for all the likes. It's been fun so far. We'll be wrapping up to our stream today later with uh, Dark and Darker. But for now, see you, thieves. Uh, Aaron, thank you very much for the 39 months as a Raptor Hatchling. Absolutely loving the streams. Well, thank you. Yeah, we played Anno 1800 earlier. We're up against the ropes. It's getting bad. But that only means that we're going to make a triumphant comeback. That's what makes movies really good, like Star Wars and stuff, like when the uh, when the good guys are down. Like, you know, starting from zero and then just having a victory isn't as interesting as, like, losing a lot and then coming back with, like, one final blow. That's what makes that really fun. Yeah, I haven't seen too much uh, PvP in this game uh, lately. Although we've we've had a bit of PvP, it seems about the same. But the last few times we played, it's we've just gotten lucky by having uh, no reavers come near us, which is nice. Which is nice. Hey, what's up, Naruki? Hello, hi everybody. Welcome. Let me check Discord. Oh, okay. Interesting. Okay. All right. <clears throat> well, she fox is having a snack, so we're going to start by loading up the ship. I'm going to do like a two player and then yeah, Uthris if you're watching or whoever will play. Uh, two to three for a brigantine. I guess we'll do that. Why not? And I'll invite a friend later on. Cool. Yahar. Ah. You see a new short? Oh, good. I hope you all enjoyed our video that went live a little bit earlier, just before this video, too, about another World War II game, turn-based strategy, called um, Headquarters World War II. I wanted to make a video on it because I, I feel like we're getting close to having a like a demo or a playtest to it, or maybe possibly a, a, a release. Bow, bow. Ooh, season nine's here. Wait, I feel like that's old. Okay. Right, so it'll probably be me and She Fox, but we're standing by for if somebody else joins. In the meantime, I'll get the ship loaded, which is totally fine. Let me adjust that. There we go. Yahar. Bum ba da bum ba da bum 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 bum. Now we gotta put a skin on this ship. Chad, I feel like we're gonna have to start playing Anno 1800 and like uh, Generation Zero like twice a week. <sighs> With She Fox. It's just. It's too much time in between. I wanna play more games. Yahar. Ooh, the ship's pretty well loaded already. Hmm. Yar. Yar. All right, cool. Let's go find more stuff. Oh, we're on this island again.
Maybe Buford T Gamer will join us. We'll see. Nice to be joining a live stream again. Oh, good. Welcome to everybody watching live. Good to see you. Good to see you, chat. In the inventory, all organized to my liking. Trying to be an organized pirate. Maybe we'll teach um, She Fox how to fish today. Actually, I think she already has. I don't know. A ship on the horizon. Oh, yep, there it is. Thoughts on Diablo 4? What do you mean? I mean, I haven't played it, so I don't know. Ooh, more fireworks. More bananas needed? Yeah. Nanners are good. I usually like coconuts or... Uh, I always find coconuts the most. Pomegranates and then like barely any pineapples. Which are best on pizza, right chat? Yahar. Yahar, see? What's up? What's poppin'? Food. Food you're eating? Uh, do, you need, do you need a minute to, to break? You can take a break. No. Okay. I'm just loading up the ship full of booty. What is a ghost pirate's favorite tea? Booty. All right, well, if you're not going to laugh at it, I'm going to do this. <laughs> there we go. Tee hee. Oh, I'm what? looking for it on. Huh? Never okay. mind. Are you... Do you need an invite? Or are you here? Probably. Oh. I'm gonna see if I can just join you. Bruce, friends or something. Hmm. Oh, Jerry's online. I'll invite Jerry. He won't come. He's busy, but I'll bother him anyway. I'll let him know I love him. Ba, 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 ba. I didn't see Uthris online either. I think Uthris is on his way back from Florida chat. I think he's taking a flight. Ah, it'd be cool to play with him again, though. I don't get to play enough games with him. But he'll join us tonight for Dark and Darker. But tonight, She Fox has a bedtime. Sadly. Correct. It makes her sad. Oh. 
Okay, we got food. Ask Jerry to bring chicken tenders. That'd be a good thing. We need some food. Did you get in? Oh, yeah, there yeah, you I'm are. In. What's up, pirate? Co pirate? Har. You har? Alright, I'm uh, just loading booty. Be a bit quiet because I'm eating. Okay. Yeah, we can hear you eating. You're a bit loud. What are you having? Okay. Is it good? All right, I'll buy her some time, chat, before we get underway on our ship. I'm going to load it up with stuff while she's eating, likely pierogies, with a side of kielbasa. And beets. Don't lie. We know that's what you eat. If I'm wrong, correct me now. Okay. It's a pasta. Solo. Is there a way to uh, change mouse sensitivity in the game? Mm, maybe. I don't know where. Oh, hey Uthris, how's it going, man? If you'd like to join us now, uh, we have a, we're just getting started. If you want a little warm up before D D. Yeah, he's talking about how you have to <laughs> you have to download Dark and Darker's latest uh, play test with the um, with a with a torrent as if it's like 2009 again. Anyway, doors open. Whoa, whoa, whoa! I thought it was gonna die. The patch link on Twitter was DMCA2. Bro, this company is so butthurt. Nova Systems or whatever? Boy. What a bunch of to corporate toddlers. The people trying to shut down Dark and Darker are only going to make it more and more successful, and then people are just going to retaliate on Steam and just bomb every single one of Nexion's games. I, I think... What was the one game they made? Story of Seasons or something? Like, what... How could you be so wrong that you octuple down on, like, being like, yeah, these third-party assets that we pay another company for are owned by us. I mean, it's just a, a derailed train of incompetence that's just r ridiculous. Which is why we get frustrated all the time as YouTubers when we just try to, like, live stream for you guys. And then it's like, oh, dude, yeah, um, Katy Perry's uh, California Girls played for 11 seconds, so your stream shut down. It's like, nobody's watching the stream to hear K Katy Perry. They're here for games, dude. Yeah, well, the record company now owns your thing.
Okay. You're here for Katy Perry? Yeah, I'm sure you are. You played Mangione a lot? Yeah. Well, people want to play Dark and Darker. They don't want to play Story of Seasons or whatever. But it's like, just say you were wrong. Say our bad. Take the hit for it. And then just, you know. Like how? I don't know. I think Dark and Darker did a good job of explaining it, though, by showing, like, oh, yeah, most of our files match because they're assets from the third-party thing that we plan to change. Oh, dude, are, do you have wizards in your game? Dude, those are copyright. Bows, arrows, rangers, uh, medieval times. Uh, medieval times, if you guys didn't know, is actually owned by medieval times. Like, they're shutting down, uh, <laughs> Lord of the Rings is getting DMCA'd by medieval times. Dude, Gandalf's copyright, dude. He can now be called, maybe perhaps Randolph, the GR, however you spell it, A or G, with an E or an A. You gotta, you gotta change that, dude. The wizard formerly known as copyright infringement. Yeah, English language. Yeah, if you're using a keyboard, those letters are copyright, dude. I don't know. It just sucks the fun out of stuff. And, like, honestly, on this channel, and I'm sure with you guys, you just want to, like, not hear any of that crap and play a game. So it's nice, like, when you can jump into SimCity or City Skylines or Sea of Thieves or something and just build or shoot or go do something and not worry about all the other stuff. Like, sometimes you just want to go throw a grenade in Call of Duty and kill a bunch of people. Even if you're bad at it, it's just fun. But then once there's shenanigans going on, Bobby Kotick, then, uh, you know, people, people don't like your game anymore. Oh, hi, Bradford. Uthrus, Bar uh, Bradford, if you'd like to join us, the door is open. We're just getting the ship ready to sail. Am I going to play Minecraft Legend? Um, you know, I actually was looking at it, and it looked quite fun. And I would like to play Minecraft Legends. Um, so I'll have to look. When does that come out? Bradford, you'll join. Give me a few. Okay, well, we're on your Brizantine. We're on the Bufordine. And then this will give Uthra's time to try out the bard and stuff. <sighs> I'm so glad you're home, Uthra's. I hope you get a good time to play with uh, your brother and stuff, too. If if he's still interested in playing. Or if you play with... Um, uh, I always forget your other friend's name who plays Railroads Online a lot with you. It's very good. I don't know. Uthra's got a good game. A uh, good bunch of people to game with. He's going to pass on to Torrance ATM. Oh, okay. Fair enough. You need to get some levels? Yeah. Well, I found out a really cool thing for the cleric. The cleric gets this, like, locust attack. I was attacked with it once, and I was like, oh, this is dumb. It didn't really do any damage to me. I must have stepped out of the zone, but it's like a AoE effect where it, like, paints a circle on the ground, and then locusts will attack whoever. Very good on bosses, because typically the bosses are very slow, and you can, you know, body block. I don't know. I just want to. I want to get really good at Dark and Darker because it's the only game that I've really. Because you can play with friends, like Skyrim, all the stuff of the other games where it was like min maxing stats and stuff is not really as fun. But I don't really care much about. Uh, boy, the first night we played it, Dark and Darker was an absolute mess. Like the first level was way too hard. People were literally people didn't even know how to complete the first level. Like, there was a problem with, like, figuring out how the hell to get through gates and stuff like that. And there was a trick to it. But we figured it out later on. 
But now it's kind of back to how it normally was. It's a few changes, of course, but... You know what's nice about Dark and Darker, though? It feels like a game that came out years ago that's suddenly popping off again. And I don't know why that's so cool. Ah, Buford T. Gamer. Yahar. Anyway, thank you guys for subscribing to the channel. Welcome to all the new members. Thank you very much for smashing the like button. Good to see you all here for some more Sea of Thieves. Yahar. Chief Fox is just finishing a snack. Bradford's getting ready. And uh, what a delight. I'm glad we have people surprising us. This is absolutely bananas. You and Indominated in D&D. &D. Uh, have you already played? I don't know. I want to see all the, the tactics and things you come up with, Uthris. I think you are very good at leading a raid, or whatever you want to call it. But additionally, I think there's a lot of things about that game that just add, like, I have so many more questions about, like, strength, true strength. There's, like, true strength, strength, false strength, accused strength. <laughs> there's, like, all these terms, and I'm like, dude, I, man. Oh, when the, f when the first play test happened, yeah. I wish I would have joined it long, long ago. Alright, I think we're loaded on stuff. Uh, Bradford, if you want to decorate the ship, go ahead. Whatever you want to do before we leave. Girl, look at that peach. You got a nice peach. No! Peachy keen. Mm, they see. Wow, we got a lot of ammo. Damn. All right, cool. We'll do whatever Bradford wants. Maybe we'll go raid ships or something. Mm, 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 mm. Is Star Citizen still all style and no substance? You know, I hate to say it, but... I had the game, like, not updated after the last, last time that I played it. And I played it, like, on Friday and Saturday with uh, Rick. And uh, I just feel like I wasted my time. I, I completely uninstalled it. No, I'll probably not be playing it this year. I say that, and I'll probably play it again, and then I'll come up with the same thing. But it's like, I don't know. I feel like there's other games I should have just spent my time playing. Rather than playing Sea of Thieves... Uh, instead of playing uh, Star Citizen, I should have just played like Sea of Thieves. With She Fox or uh, Generation Zero. So many other games out there that are just more... There's just so many issues. Also, last night we played Darker Darker and there was like big server problems and then we just ended up playing <laughs> Scribblet.io. So many of you guys are cheaters. So many cheaters in the chat. Just looking at my screen and like... I didn't even get to draw anything. Everybody just cheated. God. Cheaty cheaters. Bradford would have been mad at you guys. Yeah, Star Citizen's cool for the roleplay. I don't know. I, I feel like, if, honestly, if you're going to play it, it's it, it's a game that's more fun with friends, but you're more likely to have a good time alone. Meaning, like, you can actually play it. All right, where the hell's Bradford? What the hell's he doing? Is he in the bar? Drinkford. He's, he's probably having his peach crown royal. All right, I guess we'll chill on the ship. We're fully loaded. Cannons are good to go. Yeah, we're fine. Standing by. I think Bradford's eating too. I think everybody's eating. Oh yeah, Elite Dangerous is cool too. I like I like the uh, travel and, and that stuff in Elite Dangerous. He can join any time, can he? Well, he already did. He's sitting over there. So, I'm, oh, hi, Bradford. Hey. How's it going? Good. Ahoy. Ahoy. Um, we got the ship pretty much loaded. So, whatever you want to do, I guess, since you're the most experienced of the booty. Uh, booty ass. Okay. 
Uh, Buccaneer. I'm pretty sure a lot of the sea encounters have been uh, turned up to like 10. What's so, that? Like, like all those random uh, like the skeleton Meg? ships and oh. stuff that like teleport in the Megalodon and stuff. All like they spawn more often now, so there's more action mm -hmm. apparently. Um, there's also a new chest, but I don't know how to do it. Uh, I have no idea, so I don't know how to do that part. But, well, uh, whatever you think would be fun, Reaver or Vault Run or a Sea Fortress. Uh, G Fox okay. has played for the first time last time. This is her second time playing. Right. Uh, we can. We can do a a vault if you want, but it might take a little bit of time. That's fine. Like we're ready to start, so. All right. We could do a uh, vault. We could do you know whatever whatever you feel like. Reaving. If you guys want to come over to these uh oh right this green green tent dude. make a little vote she fox is eating so I'll, I'll take care of it you good down there yahar okay notorious full locked by the sneaky josh the dosh josh the dosh all reminds right reminds me of uh killing floor Chief. it does the dosh money in. that's the only time i've ever heard the word dosh in any game <laughs> except for maybe the getaway which literally happens in like london but uh, dosh here you got it going yeah, yeah. I just have to. We have to vote for it on the ship now. Uh, I'm just running around checking barrels because the barrels actually respawn pretty quick now. So oh, you can, okay. You can loot like the entire island, and then the entire island just respawns. Oh. Well, we have a uh, hundred and thirty-one cannonballs plus cannons are loaded. So if you wanna, it, you can make it easier on yourself next time. Wait, did did you use a crate or did you run around? No, I just ran around because she was eating, so I just bought time by um, doing it the so slow can, way. I'll, I'll show you a, a quicker way. It costs you a little bit of money, but if you come up to this uh, lady, mm -hmm. you can buy... Uh, actually, there's cannonball crates someone borrowed already. Um, but if you... if You you can just buy some of the resources from her, or if you don't want to do that, you can buy a storage crate, and you can empty barrels into the storage crate now. Oh, that's nice. So, like, you can just run around holding the storage crate, empty all the barrels, and... Uh, do it and it does it really fast versus like you have to take every single item out and you have limited storage and running it all back do you want to decorate the ship bradford we gotta look uh, cute sure. don't you think how, how are you bradford how are things hello so, come on uh i'm doing pretty good i have a good weekend now if you want to do some stuff oh yeah what are your days uh, hold on and let me open the schedule pencil you in all right what days we got you for Bradford? Uh, you got me for the next two AM or PMs. Up to you. All right, we're gonna need you to download Dark and Darker. So you're saying from the 17th and 18th, or you mean today and tomorrow? Uh, well, I mean I'm obviously here tonight. Mm -hmm. But like you said, next two. So does that mean 18, 19, or does that mean the 18th? No, that means 17, 18. Mhm. Mm well, we could pencil you in for a PM Dark and Darker. I don't have Dark and Darker, so we'll scratch that one out. No, anybody can download it for free, so there's no exceptions, no excuses. Okay. Mm-hmm. I could do a midday... I have something planned for Fishing North Atlantic tomorrow, which is a single-player game, and I can uh, buff that out and put in something you'd like to play in the midday. High traction, uh, Bradford. High traction. What about that other game we talked about with that DLC that's possibly coming out that we haven't told anyone about yet? Oh, right. I haven't gotten keys from them yet. You mean Tower okay. 3D Pro? Oh, okay. Well, everyone knows about it now. All right. Uh, we're yeah. still talking about that. They were quite interested since I mentioned you were an ATC guy. But they're working on it. Um, yeah, so if you, if you go to this Merchant Alliance person, you can buy a storage crate next time so you don't have to run around to each... You can run around each barrel and store things pretty quickly. Oh, okay. How much but is this that? Is, this is a, uh, the storage crate, I think, is the most expensive one, but it's literally just an unlimited storage. Like, you can put as much stuff in it as you want. A firm Raj. So it's pretty useful to have one, because if you ever run out of resources, you just pull it out and loot an island. Standing by. Yeah. Yesterday, I made $1,000 by selling an empty storage crate if you find one. Oh, okay. Yeah, you can. Yeah, you can. It's five grand to buy one, but that's pretty cheap to what it used to be. I think it was seventeen five before. Wow. Rockefeller over here. Uh, I'll drop off our 50 cannonballs. 
Oh, you look nice. I noticed you changed your outfit create, a little bit. Create, All that money create. we got from the last vault you were able to spend. Create, 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 create. You're still wearing the under jammies, create. though. Alright, uh... Our cannonball crates... Girl, you could work it better than that. Uh, the, cannon, the cannonball barrels, the top one will have cannonballs. The, uh... Bottom left one will be specials, and bottom right one will be, uh, more the cosmetic. Bradford, I already it's... organized it according to Jerry's standards, and he's in the Navy. Alright, well, Jerry isn't here. No, Jerry, <laughs> Jerry is the sea. Oh, so he's attacking us later, okay. Maybe, I don't know. All I know is I missed him in Anno 1800, and I think I'm going to have to start calling him in. We're going to need backup. Oh, Anguish 1800. Oh! Anguish 1800? Oh, it was, it was bad. What happened in Anno? You know all what the happened? things that could go wrong in that game? It did go wrong. They did go wrong, yeah. I, actually, it's it things that I didn't even nice know could go they, wrong went wrong. It would be nice if they sped up the, the economy a little bit more in those games, so it wasn't as drawn out, though. Like you get to combat a little quicker. Uh, well, we're we're in combat. <laughs> we're free. Bradford, don't oh, you want uh, to decorate the Byzantine? Yeah, I will. I'll just get sank in like three seconds for not paying attention. I'm going to put on lo-fi music for you, Chad, okay? Enjoy. And God raise her. <laughs> Play the village people when Jerry enters the stream. I'm just going to do that later. I um, Jerry, when Jerry enters the oh, stream, it's like a WWE wrestler coming the... down. Byzantines right here. All right, underneath the stairs of the ship, I'll put the voyage. Must uh, vote. Well, I think only one person has to. Yeah. I'll de decorate the ship. Uh, decoration. You love this game, so do we. It's a treat that. Bradford is available to join us. So thank you, Bradford, for spending your time here again. Yeah, I'm trying to figure out how I did how you do this before. Oh, it's just customization. <sighs> yeah. Fox, where'd you go? Oh. Now I see. Oh, Jason, thanks for the nine months of support. Sorry if I... Hello, Daniel. Hello, uh... Haruki. New member, welcome! Alright. You guys ready? Yeah. Yeah. Right.
Bradford, we can hear you breathing. Can you? Yeah. Okay. Alright, Chief Fox, so we're going to do the same thing we kind of did last time. Okay. With the bolt. And then maybe we will do... Um, What's the other thing? The the sea forts. Those are fun. I'll be right back. I got my tea. Da. It's interesting how cool they, how nice they made the water in this without it being like a uh, like too overpowering for people's graphics. But they're able to make water look really nice. Look at this nice water after. Just makes you want to go for a swim. That's true. Yeah, chat. Uh, he's a FTC regulator. Yeah. No, I. I mean, uh, FAA. Yeah, whatever it is. The one that does the that airplanes. Is cool that you're, that you're Wait, are you streaming? Yeah. Oh, I, I, I was looking in the chat and I'm like, who the hell is he talking to? <laughs> it's like, I didn't realize you were just gonna suddenly join the stream and do your own. <laughs> that's yeah. cool. Well, that's cool. I didn't, I didn't know you were that streaming. We're, we're, uh, oh boy. This might actually be the island we need to go to. <laughs> it is. It, 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 yep, seems like it is. Ew, a splash. Bradford, slow down. This is a residential neighborhood. Oh. Are we going to find a vault? Uh, indeed we are. Yeah, we just have to dig up a bunch of uh, keys or hints or... I'll actually let you guys do this, or if you want. Oh, we'll let She Fox do it. I'm gonna loot this boat. Oh, I need to. There's a lot of stuff in this boat. I need the storage. There's a lot of curse balls in that uh, boat. Grab. 
Hey, fellers. Yeah, yeah, it is, it is pretty good. Like, uh, we're a little unorthodox because we are one of the few facilities that actually uses like a remote, what's considered a remote tower, if you know what, if you know what that is. So we actually use camera towers. We feed them to screens inside of a room that uses like 4K, so we're able to watch an entire airport's worth of traffic from one room. Uh, for one of like two facilities, actually three facilities in the, in the U.S. now, because uh, certain uh, Kansas City just did one, just made one. Um, but by volume, we are still the largest that uh, operations-wise that runs one. Um, I think the, the FAA is doing one in Leesburg. I don't know how their trials are going, and some foreign countries have used them, like uh, in the. In Northern Europe, where a lot of airports can't have a singular tower built because it's too expensive, so they'll have one remote facility run multiple airports. Bradford's so passionate about his job, chap. But he'd rather be here. I miss the chip. I miss ch the Chipford saga. <laughs> that was my favorite part of the anime so far. The Bradford anime was the chip <laughs> saga. Ooh, romantic. The sun's going down? Yes. What ship company did he work for? Intel. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no, it was it was free. Dude, imagine <laughs> imagine if Pepsi acquired Intel. That'd be the world's largest chip company, wouldn't it? In like two two fields. Yeah, Chad, after today, I think I'm going to buy my own Brizantine and my own Sloop so I can play <laughs> Captain on all of them. That's one thing we haven't really done much after it came out in Season 8 or 9. Whenever the Captain C stuff was new. I think it's this season. It's one thing I wish we uh, did a little bit more. Uh, she Fox, did you get that last little piece of gold or whatever? Yes. Uh, it was a oh, cup. Yeah. I got it. Oh, you're leaving it yeah. on the bed so they can sleep? Oh, that's nice, you. Yeah. <laughs> Aw, let's tuck them in. Do we need anything from the island? No, we got what we came for. Oh, I think I see some more stuff. Oh, yeah, go grab it. I'll tuck them in all nice now. Hey, can you guys quit beating your mics, though? Uh, I'm trying not to. Wait, what did you guys get from the island? Did you guys dig it up already? Yeah, I got the treasure map and three pieces of gold. Oh, okay. Funny thing is, if we get the second one, we might be able to find it without getting the third. Uh, where's the next one? This way. Anchors come up. Raising anchor. Hi. Some help sure would be nice. <laughs> In a second. All done. It's moving. Uh, let's see. Hmm. Nope, storm. You know what that means. Standing by, James.
I think it's right here. Is it at this one? Uh oh, there's a rock. Rock! Uh oh, I did bad. So did Bradford, I... um, what happened I there? I did not. No, we're probably leaking. I'd say we're leaking a bit. Are we? Hey, can you turn the wheel to the left, Raptor? And, uh, I can. Straighten yeah. the wheel out. Just, uh, you just have to straighten it out. Oh, sure. All straight. Thank you. Is it at this island? Uh, I think so. Looks like it. All right. Yeah. Uh. Are we gonna swim? Bradford, you were in today's YouTube short. Did you see it? Uh, no. It was something funny you did, but it was in a game you don't like. Oh. Is it on? Is it on the channel? Uh, it or? is. Yep. All right. If you go to the videos tab, it's probably the uh, the most recent short, I think. Is it construction sim? It is. Oh, I don't know. Well. Because you love that game. Oh, yeah. Hey, She Fox, why don't you go ahead and uh, climb in? How can I do it? Uh, look at the barrel of the cannon. The end of it, yep. Are you oh. Okay, ready? Yay! Still better than United. Well, I didn't bring food. I emptied all my food out. All right. Well. Oh boy, lots of fun. Okay, we got two here. Looks like a poison electric. Man, these guys are fast. Ow. Oh boy. There's a lot of them. Oh, what the hell was that? Whoa. Oh, I'm, I'm sorry. On I'm on fire. I'm on fire. I'm on fire. I'm on fire. Was that you? Did you shoot the... <sighs> There's food here in this barrel. Next to me. Jason, thanks for gifting it. Chat five memberships, dude. Thank you very much for the support. Pomegranate. Promota. Promota. Contrabando. You guys find it? Uh, no, I was kind of like trying not to die. Let Chief Fox dig this one up. I will explore. Chief Fox? Hello? Yeah, I'm here. I'm trying to shoot myself Ooh, from the cannon. Food. Oh. Get over here, food.
I'm over here just standing by. Coming. I want you to get experienced with booty. Oh no. Are we are we dealing with Oh boy. Hi. Chicken. Oh, hi. Whoa. Oh, we better dig this up and get out of here. Uh, it's right around here somewhere. How can I choose a shovel? Uh, press Q <laughs> and then 5. <laughs> Delicious. I look a gem. Grab that. Uh, it's right about where I am. Right here. There you go. Nice work. Uh oh. Hell yeah. Rip and dip. Alright, you pick up the. Uh... Oh wow, there's lots of stuff to pick up. Oh hey, I'm on fire. Okay, chat. Who wants to? Who wants some pork chops? Bradford, are you on the boat? No. Are you cooking? <laughs> yeah. Wow, that makes a huge plume of smoke. Do you see that? You'd be able yeah. to see somebody from like across the map. Uh, she Fox, we're gonna have to come back here and pick up a few things. Okay. But we'll put it on the beach first, wherever the boat is. Where's the boat? That's a huge plume of smoke. Oh, come on. No more attacking, what? please. What is that? Raffer, can we pull the boat closer? We found a few things. Uh... Sure. I don't care. I don't even know where the boat is. Hello. Oh, okay. Eh. Eh. Come back here. Wait a minute. Maybe... Maybe if she Fox is home early enough, Bradford will play Hunt Showdown. I've also Tomorrow? seen you guys have been doing a lot of Generation Zero as well. Well, that's kind of our thing, you know. Okay. We, we started it together. We're going to finish it together. Well, maybe. It's kind of the same with Anno, but at this point... We need some help. Yeah, we need Jesus. I'm going to swim out to the boat and, uh... Hello, Mr. Chicken. What, what? You have met your maker. Not now, sir. It is a long swim out here. Too long. Get the piece of the map? Yeah. Map 
piece. But there's like two more pieces of uh, gold on the island. Oh. Okay. And then there's these guys, which are dropping like red hearts. One is dead. Oh, Good you deeds done. Dirt. You took your four-year-old to the Mario movie today and enjoyed it. Oh hell yeah! I, I actually wanted to go and see that, so it's good that so many people who are like adults and kids are liking it. That's always good when like the you know you can bring the kids to something, or if you got cousins or nieces or something or nephews that you want to bring, and that's cool, man. Always good when there's fun for the whole family. Kind of I saw it. That was a pretty good oh, movie. You saw it? Yeah. Oh good. Whoa, Bradford, do you have actual uh, doubloons there? It sounded like you were throwing around gold coins. Yeah, I mean. You are. My motorized, my motorized vehicular device. Oh, your car keys. Car. <laughs> car keys. My car keys. Yeah, car. Uh, oh, you guys are getting loot. Yeah, we're kind of into booty. Are you into booty, Bradford? Are you a loot guy or a booty guy? Uh, my booty's three thousand miles away. Oh, well, yeah, so is the ship. If you could pull it closer, that would kind of help out the whole process of getting this stuff aboard. If you could maybe bring it around to the valet side, that'd be nice, rather than parking six blocks away, Bradford, just in case the cops are oh, around. I'm sorry, there's like a sandbar between us and the island. <laughs> sandbar? Yeah. Did we get everything? I thought there was like one more thing here. Oh, oh yeah, there it is. The oh, way, over yeah. here. Uh-oh. Alright, coming back to the boat. What? Bradford like big likes big chests of pirate gold. <laughs> yeah, example. it's either you like big chests or <laughs> you know big booty or big loot. You know. There are so many chickens. I'm not fighting these guys anymore. I'm going home. I'm not fighting. I'm out of here. Ooh, almost destroyed a hundred skeletons. Oh, someone died. She Fox is dead. What? Yeah, I'm down. There was a guy with a barrel. Now I'm coming. I don't know if I'll be there in time. Uh, probably not. Nope. Damn it. Sorry. Did you? Were you carrying anything? Nope. But there's a. Uh... Chest where I died to. Oh, a chest? Yeah. Uh, was it like a storage chest? What the hell? Wait. What? The skill, did the skeleton ship win that uh, engagement? I think they did. So that is the... Oh no, that's the skeleton fleet. Yeah, so they probably won. Or they're still in it. Are you watching players? Yeah, they're fighting the skeleton fleet. What type of ship? The alien. Oh, okay.
Oh, I'm. I mean, I'm, I'm waiting for you guys to get aboard so I can we can go to look, get to get the other pieces. I mean, I'm here. So is she. I'm here. We're kind of waiting on you, Bradford. Oh, storm! <sighs> Put yeah. your sword away. All right, Brad, do you think we got enough to find this island, or you need one more? Uh, probably one more. Okay. Uh, oh. Oh, hello. You want a coconut, sir? Take some minor structural damage. Thank you. I'll check for structural damage. Is there? Yeah, that's why we're taking on water. Hey, we're on fire. No, nah, I, I put my sword away before it hit. I knew it was coming. Dumb game. Oh, well. I'm staying below deck. All right, I'm coming up. Uh, can I get the front mass down? Front mass down, I. We just took uh, damage from the storm. She Fox, can you do repairs? Yeah, I'm doing it. Uh, what? I'm doing it. Yeah. You mean Yahar or I? Oh yeah. Yeah. What's up, James? What's up, Steggy? Our schedule is uh, down below in the description. Exclamation point schedule. Thanks for watching. Yeah, this thing looks like a dodgeball. This pomegranate. <laughs> what? What's up, Calamity Bob? Thanks for the 23 months. Drink up me hearties. Yeah. Welcome. Reminds me of the, uh, I don't know why, it reminds me of, uh, Haunted Turnips. Oh. Yeah. Or the, uh, the Halloween Turnips. You know, before we carved Pumpkin's Raptor, in, uh, back in, like, like way before we carved pumpkins, they used to carve turnips. Really? Yeah. Evil turnips.
What's it? Wait, a turnip is like the like the big white one, right? Like the it's like a like a beet kind of, right? Yeah, but it's white. Yeah. yeah. I used to carve turnips and put candles in them. I don't know what it tastes like. I don't know if I've had a turnip or if I could like think of what the flavor of it is. I want to try beets. Oh, you've never had beets? I love beets. Beets are very good. They're earthy, Bradford. I like pickled beets. <laughs> We're on it again? Mm -hmm. the, th the thing is, whenever someone like, says something is earthy, I just picture them just like eating dirt, dirt and yeah. eating it to the... <laughs> I would say like, you know... This, this wine is earthy. You know how a baked potato... It, you know how a baked potato tastes, Bradford? Yeah. It's got that kind of a taste, like it's a, it's a no, tuber. It's like a, it's like a, uh, well, ve vegetables kind of taste fresh and citrusy, right? Like they've kind of no. got more of a no? Or more of a starchy sort of taste. Well, no, that's a potato. Oh. Well, like a green bean, right? A green bean kind of could be sweet and like you know, crispy and like Well, this is a guy we're talking about food pallets coming from a guy who eats like, you know, microwavable mac and cheese <laughs> and skedios. I'll never forget Bradford's face when he tried that uh, <laughs> sake. He was trying to be so nice that he hated it. Oh, Raptor bought me something. I'll have to be nice, but I hate this. However, I will be honest. Thanks, I think the captain. Me and Bradford ate our body weight in French fries at the state fair. <laughs> so that burger was. Really oh, you like the burger? Oh, that was a buffalo burger, wasn't it? Yeah. I got was one too. Yeah, that was good. I forgot that's what we had. Oh my god, the fries are. State fair. Oh my god. Ah, oh, dude, that was amazing. It's the, dude, I'm still, I'm so salty about the bucket, though. Oh, yeah. The bucket having, like, the little Facebook thing on yeah, it. Yeah, yeah. I paid for a collectible. I don't want your Facebook. The burger. only other size bigger than that, Bradford, must have been, like, wheelbarrow size. <laughs> like, at that point, we would have had to, like, rented a truck and, like, loaded it up. Like, got a shovel. You know, like, when they load stuff and, like, dude, for farming. Dude, if any of you guys make a business where you have to pay extra for a collectible, don't put a Facebook brand on the front of the collectible. Yeah. You got it working? Awesome, Ufus. Good to hear, man. What are we doing? Shooting dudes or what? Uh, this island has the one of the pieces on it. Well, I see one shiny. Yar. All right, so we had to get up, get on there. Okay. Going in. I wonder if Bradford likes blue cheese on a steak. I'd say no. No. Yeah. But I bet she fox would like that. Would like what? Blue cheese on a steak. I don't think you'll like what I, what I, how I like my steak. I, oh, yeah. Yeah, I know how he likes the steak. Disappointing. How? Oh, well done. Yeah, actually. I can hear her tabbing out and just deleting from <laughs> Steam friend list. <laughs> Blocking on uh, Discord. Friendship over. Found a treasure chest here. Oh, hi. Wow, that was fast. Whoa, where'd you go? Got him. Yahar. Best receipt. Oh, well, we still have to dig up the key, so... Yeah. I always love how there's, like, other... Th like, on the main quest. <laughs> like, you go to these tiny little islands, and there's, like, 17 side things on, like, the island. Like, you can fish, you can pick up a bunch of extra booty, there's, like, other enemies that drop loot, then there's a box to, like, pick up. We have a little boat here, too, Brad, for, like, a little rowboat. Oh, hey, you guys have picked up a love treasure. Did anybody, uh, have that treasure chest? Nope. 
No. Yeah, I put it. Yeah. Where what? is it? I put it in the ship and filled it with. Already? Oh. Um. Yeah. <laughs> Why do you think I cannon myself? I don't know. I don't know, Bradford. There's a rat. A rat. Where'd that rat go? A little mouse. Oh, oh. wait. <laughs> <laughs> what? That's definitely one of your better impressions. Thank you, Roy Gray, for becoming a researcher. Oh, dude, Roy, Roy's over there. Yeah. What do you mean? You mean Take Roy? All, dude. Or Rod? Here you go, Raptor. What? Hey, Raptor. What? Here you go. Hello. Hey, do I see something cool? What? Fireworks? Oh, you no. put the doggo in there. I didn't know you had a dog. Oh, oh boy. Whoa. He'll be back. <laughs> oh, no, he's still falling. You can buy your own pet. It's cool. Monkeys, birds, cat, dog. Isn't there a... I think the monkey's the newest one, right? That's what I thought. <laughs> Can I keep up? I asked you about that. I was like, You're Roy, so you mean I Rod? Like... <laughs> I was like, wait a minute. <laughs> I'm sorry. Kitty. Hi, Rod. Thanks for supporting Bradford, too. That's nice of you. Keeping the dog. Just wait for the OBS AI voice raptor and we'll be able to do any voice he wants. Oh. What? He took the dog with him. Oh. Like they all do, apparently. She Fox has got the joke. She do. She do. All right, we ready to go? Yes. Oh, you named your dog Inferno. Oh. Your name? What? Oh, yeah, yeah, Yahar. Yeah, <clears throat> yeah. Okay. So now we got the whole map, right? Or no? Yeah, we do. No, we don't. Oh, it's a four piece. I thought there were always three. But we know where that island is, right, Bradford? But we just don't know where on the island it is. I'll mark the island while we wait. Are you guys like. Hello? Hello? Oh, okay. Nobody's talking to me. I feel lonely. I'm enjoying the poppy now. The poppy. The poppy. Oh. 
Can I have one too? Yeah, you can buy one at the store when we get back. Will we be playing AoE 4 again? Uh, well, when we do, it'll probably be on the schedule down below, exclamation point schedule. Or check down below in the description. Kitty sounds like a dog. They got that wrong. Is she? Uh, uh, yeah, what? She, well, someone wrote Snack Fox, but I think that's from your character last night. But yeah, She Fox is a is a goof trooper. Yeah. Har. Yeah, har. Are we doing a musical? Okay, we gotta go... yep. Is Brad's mic off? No. Sometimes they get quiet, and then I try to, like, fill the dead space with a joke or something, and then it's just dead quiet, and then it's like, oh. <laughs> like, I try to pull a Jerry Seinfeld, like, uh, what's the deal with airline food? And then, yep, this. Yep, that, yeah. <laughs> That's how it is, yeah. <laughs> No better feeling of being lonely than literally standing next to somebody who doesn't respond. That's fine. <laughs> A radio silence, yeah. I saw the Lion King uh, musical at a theater in London last week. Really good. Oh, good. Oh, the, wow, yeah. Th that play is still going. It's been a long time. That was like on Broadway. Sure, I fucking... Let's see if we can uh, do a little of this. Well, thank you.
Man, you guys just hate your mics. You guys just beat them. Hmm? You guys just be getting, beating your mics all the time. We're, we're quiet. You're too quiet. Then, well, you like, you're I mic. make a joke and then you guys don't say anything and then it's just like you guys communicate like punching your mic. It's like communicating with apes. <laughs> I feel like Jane Goodall. It's like, uh, we're here with Choo Choo and Bew Bew. And we're gonna try to communicate with them on how to... How to operate a Byzantine. I'm sorry, I don't have, like, professional mic here. I know, but it, it's just... You guys always hit your mics, why do you do that? I'm not hitting anything. Alright, I'm gonna tell you guys when you are do we it. In the same, are we in the same team speak? Because I don't hear any of it. Bradford, you're the type of guy who would literally live in an apartment with like four smoke detectors and they'd be chirping at different intervals for all the low battery and they would be changed for years. That wouldn't drive you nuts, hearing that chirp? Uh, probably not. Yeah, I knew it. Actually, you know what? You know what? Actually, it probably would because I get a lot of stuff work, to be honest. Yeah, I'd, I'd probably last maybe a couple hours. He doesn't have a bed frame, so there's that. Yeah, that's true, Brad. <laughs> I don't have a bed frame. Bradford, no bed frame, Ferd. <laughs> that's his. That's his full name. Bradford, no bed frame, shame. No frame, all shame. The Buford T game gamer story. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I forgot about that. Brad, are you shooting your dog again? A shot's fired. A shot's fired. Nope. All right, let's go. There could be there could be loot and booty. Piggy. A lot of, uh, hello. Oh, doggo. Oh, what on me? Back to the boot. Marty. These masked zombies now. What? Hey, who's making pork? You burned your damn pork that was probably chop. Me. Uh, and of course, it's well done, and I got a Steam achievement for it. <laughs> well, it must be for Bradford, so I'll leave it by the uh, thing. Maybe I could load in the camera. Uh, there's something good about like a good charred gristle on a steak. Uh, all right, the gristle, yeah. The steak itself, no. Oh, you're right though. I do like a chard outside, which is nice about grilling because you can get the you can get the char, but then keep it uh, you know medium rare or medium. Yeah. Well. Uh, well, well, well. I marked it uh, on the map, by the way. It's to our northeast. Actually, direct direct north, and we can get there. Yahar. In a second. Yeah. 
You want to stop by that C fort first, Bradford? It's right there. Uh, we can if you want. I mean, you know, it's right there. You are. So you first need to find the island that's on first too. So. All right. Yeah, go ahead. You can see us forward. Uh, are you? All right. Do you want to like shoot off into it? Yeah. Okay. All right, sails down, please. Yar. Wait, I already found the island, Bradford. I told you it was to our north. Yeah. I don't know. Do we have the key already? Oh no. Well, no. I thought this next island that we go to is where we get the key. Then we have to go to one more island. Oh, that might be it. Yeah. Yeah, we get the key, we dig up the key, and then it tells us what key the vault island is on. Yeah, yeah, that, that is right. We can actually probably just sail right up to the fort, to be honest. As long as someone hops out, helps out. It begins. All right, so here's what's gonna happen, She Fox. There's a fort here. It's gonna shoot at us. Bradford's gonna go and basically fire himself via cannon to the fort and like kill the actually, guys who are shooting at us. Just, I think we should just run up on it. All right, we're gonna go ahead and run up on the go, fort. Go to the left side. I'm gonna go, go to the left, left side. side. Yeah, the anyway, we're gonna, there's a big fight. Oh, damage on the bow. On it. Just run up next to the thing and then set the anchor next to the dock. We're all gonna hop off. I'll grab the water. You get. I need somebody on anchor here shortly. Yep. Alright, uh. We'll go to the left a little bit. One. Alright, anchor. How are we doing on damage? Oh, it's bad. Uh, we have water. Alright, uh, we need... Okay, I'll sort out the ship stuff. Oh, is there a one? There's a hole. Yeah, she's got it. She Fox has got it. Yep. Alright, so, boss battle. Let's go. Yep. Oh, this music's the best. Alright. Uh, I'm gonna grab ammunition in the storage crate. Raj. And you guys can go Alright, we're going this way. Can we get up here? Fully loaded on cannibals and Yar.
Another wave. She Fox, where are you? Oh, there you are. Here. All right, stay together. Okay. Watch the stairs. Two on the stairs, three. Mm -hmm. My hype for the Mandalorian finale. I haven't watched it in a while. I've been busy, but it's been good. Bradford, I think, talked a lot about it in chat with you guys. About time Bradford made a mandatory... Uh, appearance absolutely case okay, Dan. thanks for the 19 months people use their member milestone to like tell Bradford to get in <laughs> I love you guys they love you as well Bradford Firm. She fox up the stairs. There's a lot of them. Okay. I'm gonna eat this burnt ass pork chop. Thanks, Bradford. Probably make you sick. Yeah, I need to wash it down with coconut. I need to fill this sword crate and move the ship around. Raj. Dropping loot in center room. Waiting to get stabbed for behind. Chief Fox, you good? Yeah. What's that? Fighting. Fell down. Oh, there the it is. Dog. Next wave. Just, I uh, fell down through the dock. Just like glitched through the map. 
There's the boss. Get him once. He's on me. Coming to you. I need to heal. I think I hit him. Oh, damn. He knocked me off. I'm good. I just need to get back up there. Oh. Uh, sir, I don't appreciate being shot. Dead. Good job. Nice. Uh, hey, uh, Shinrock, come here. You can pick yeah. the key up. Oh, wait. Yeah, there's a key that dropped right here. You got on. Oh, no. You didn't pick it up. Oh. Yeah. Here. There's okay. There's a key that dropped there. If you got onto the basement, you can open up the storage. Uh, okay. For or the loot area. Uh, bring all the loot from that area down to the loading uh, dock, like below it, like in the same room. Okay. I'm gonna bring the ship around, it'll make it easy. I'm just looting all the barrels. Uh, if you search all the cabinets too, we can find there's a uh, auxiliary treasure room or a storage room in the top. Yep, that's true. Floor. And all those drawers, yep. Uh, I've already searched the mess hall, so it's uh, either on tier 2 or tier 3, the key for that. I'm in the bunk room. That's yeah, probably in there. I'm gonna go up I one got more it. floor. Oh yeah. I got the storeroom key. Can you key. say again where yeah. should I use the key? Uh, it's in the basement. For the for this uh, treasure room. Wait, I got a key too. What isn't there one that's on the top? Yeah, that's yeah, it's right here. Oh, this is the one I get. Okay, there's yeah. two keys. Yeah. So. Uh, we got a lot of booty. Yep. A lot of stuff, man. It's totally worth it. Look at that. Look around for enemy boats. Got fireworks, nice. All right, uh, I'm going to bring the boat around. Make the loading easier. All right. Uh, bring this down to half. Order. have to move those gold items I put down here. Alright, I'm on the move with the boat. Hard turn. I think this opens. Bradford, isn't there a way to open the grate that's in the hallway? Oh, right here. Uh, she Fox, do you have the key? Ah, oh, nicely done. I, uh, okay. I still, oh, here, okay. Hell yeah. Yahar. Yahar, hey, come here. Take a seat. On the skull? I mean, you can, yeah, yeah, there you go. Wow. <laughs> hey, hey. Uh, if you open... No, no, not that door. The other, this way. This way with the loot. I what? Can, you can grapple it right onto the ship. Oh, yeah. We're just... She just found the room. Uh, you have to lower this door, though. I'll uh, take everything out. You can load it if, if that... No, no, no. You don't have to take it outside. What do you mean? See where that? Uh, you see that lower area below the? 
It's over here. Yeah, but I mean, we have to take it out of the room. Oh, yeah. Sorry. To rank. Do I just shoot it? Wait, you put it on like a lift. I can't get to it now. Oh, pull it back this way. Thank you. I wonder. Oh, well, the pulley can go down, I think. Can't it? All right, she fox. I'll, I'll yeah. put everything out in the hallway. Uh, should we get everything from the auxiliary room? Should I go recheck that? Uh, there is more stuff up there. Yeah, there's one more okay, thing. I will. There's still some stuff in the mid room. I'll try to grab everything. Did you check all the um, cabinets? Because those can have no. I too. think I got most of them, but I don't think I got all of Here them. Here is a treasure chest to carry small items. If there's any more small items in that room, oh yeah, there is. Here you go. You can put them in that. I will. No. She fox. Yeah. That skull can go. What in. is it? Uh, put it in the treasure chest. Yeah, oh, okay. Three items in that. Makes things easier. So what we're doing, by the way, she fox is gonna give us like a five. What is it, Bradford? A five times bonus or whatever? What do you mean? Like oh. if, if we go back with like tier five, we get like a five time That's, bonus, right? Yeah, yeah, and uh, we also get. I think we get more, just straight up more money and more rep or something. I don't, know, I don't know how it works. If you turn your emissary in, the higher the level, like the more you get from it. That's right. And I believe the... I don't know how it works. But so we're going to be higher, a bi higher the better. <laughs> big money McGillicuddy. Can I push it? Oh, uh, yeah. Just a drop down. There's a drop down in this room. Not one in uh, we can Do we have a small boat? We can go back to oh, the boat sure. and uh, like use the grappling hook now. Do you want to store or do you want to shoot? I can store. Okay. Damn. Uh, there's that over there. Let me go out and get this other piece of meat. Nope. Mm -hmm. I don't Maybe think he's gonna reach from here. No, it's reaching, but... I think it has to be lowered. Yeah, but it's... Can you lower it? It's hitting it? the gate. No, this is the part that's not you, moving. You can't lower it? N no, because it's already it's all the way down. It's here in the water. The upper part doesn't move. Like it. That one. Oh, here, yeah, okay. Thank you. Oh, you can fall down through that. Fully automatic booty machine. I realize I loaded onto the boat now. Thanks. You're welcome. I didn't realize I auto loaded onto the boat. I didn't either. I thought that's what I was. I thought I thought I always dropped in front of the boat. Yeah, and you'd have to turn to the side and have somebody grab it or whatever. 
It's a nice addition that they added. That must be new. Yes. Quick looting. We're gonna have to the north. We go. Yahar. Or I might have to spin this around the other way. That means it's a lot easier to do a drive-by on like barrels and stuff. Or like after a Kraken, you know? Oh yeah. Or the skeleton fleet. Right. Well that's nice. You are. Hey Andred. Welcome to the stream, bruh. Sup, bruh. Looted. Captain Smiley faces in the chat. Smiley. Good to see you. Ghost effects are awesome. Yeah, they are on like all the crates and stuff. Really weird looking. Good job, She Fox. That's uh, we're off to a good start with big money. Yahar. Yahar. That, that's that's the attitude I want to see. Dude, we're gonna. You know what? You keep this up. I can convince Bradford to pull us into a Wendy's. No, a Taco Bell. He knows the secret menu. Secret menu of thieves. <laughs> you know what this reminds me of, Bradford? Seeing all these chests and stuff laying around? It's frickin' uh, Void Train. <laughs> Like when we duped all the stuff please, in Void Train. Don't me. You know, that kind of reminds me, uh, oh, right, Bradford. Right. <laughs> reminds me that Void Train is coming out soon, Bradford. I'm going to need a day. Dude, the first day we play that, I, th I think we play that for nine hours straight. It was cool solving those puzzles. Yeah, it was. Yeah, definitely. Uh, definitely interesting. Though, it was kind of repetitive. Until we, we did. Yeah, but we didn't have any, like, enemy fighting until we got to the second one, and then there's actually the second time we played, and then, you know, that last time we played, where there's actual enemy trains that came up next to us. Yeah, that, oh, that was sweet. That was, that was nuts. That freaked us out. Uh, I did like the system, too, where, like, we had to grapple away from the train to go into the puzzle areas. Oh, yeah. I thought that was nice. Where did we store all this loot? Everywhere. We're chest, lousy. The chests need more. Uh, I wonder if there's mods for that game. There definitely probably is. You want us to play uh, Void Train with She Fox? Yeah, she's invited to a mandatory. I, I really hope they've up. No, actually, you know what? I have no hope that they've updated the chests in that game. I'm absolutely destroyed. I don't know. I mean, they may have. I don't know. We thought we, we literally stopped playing for a year, and they still did not figure out how to play the chests. Alright, fair. But they did do a lot of changes to the train. Remember where we remember where we had to like make an entire train car of those chests just to fit all of our stuff and it still wasn't enough. Oh my enough. god, that's true. And we had to duplicate a chest a million times to what were we trying to do like just to upgrade the train or wait, weren't we up like weren't we um, glitching ice so we could make steam? Yeah, I chunk ones so we had to use to convert into uh, like these those coal those coal piece chunk things that we could put into the engine yeah uh. yeah She Fox is a girl. That's right, boys. You can add her on the Discord. Send those friend requests. Oh, come on. <laughs> I'm just an AI. Yeah, this is just a new AI bot we're testing out. <laughs> it's, um, like, it's to simulate what it would be like to have a girlfriend. <laughs> just so us gamers are, like, getting, we're getting ready for the real world to, like, be around girls. <laughs> So if and when I ever encounter a girl in the real world, I'll be ready to, like, you know, <laughs> I'll be ready for the experience. Or anybody, really. I mean, 
You guys will be able to download this soon from the internet. Hi, I'm Raptor the Goof Troop, and now with uh, Girl GPT, you can now... That's what it stands for, Girl Pretending uh, to Be Real? I don't know. I'll have to figure out an acronym, but anyway. Uh, at Grade 5, you get 150% Wow. Bonus. The Grade, thanks to the six months. New member, welcome. See, so you, you get like double and a half. You get like double and a half. Yeah. Uh, you realize you're on the poop deck there, uh, ma'am? Oh, wait. Where are we at? Your thing? Nothing. I'm, I'm gonna be over here. Go to the north. Hey, Bradford, do we still have our rowboat? I don't know. Did you hook it up? No, I thought you did. No. Okay. I did not. Another one. <laughs> uh, I'm watching you from France, man. I like your videos, but I don't understand anything. But keep it up. I support you. Thank you very much. Merci <laughs> beaucoup. Is there another one? Wow. There is. You know what's the... Uh, where's all this wind coming from that's in our sails? Oh, that's right. <laughs> the friend requests. <sighs> <laughs> it's the wind in our sails. Oh, you were singing so long for that one. <laughs> well, well you, knew I, you knew already what I was going to say when I started laughing before I said it. You're cringe. You're cringe. How dare you? <laughs> you are cringe. I said pure, not you. Oh. Also, why why are we going with you got this you got the sweet jacket on, but this is real basic here. We got we gotta get this fixed. I don't even think you have shoes on. Ugh. Oh, you got good nails though. Girl, did you get a pedicure before we went on the ship? What the hell? Of, of course I did. I think you went to the I same place Bradford bar goes to. <laughs> Manny Petties! Ooh. Are we going in Bradford or are we just passing by? Oh boy. Okay, yeah, so did that oh. cannonball. Wow. Trying to take one to the face. Yep. Passing by. We're not gonna go yes. for it? Oh. Uh, well, we the, the, the yeah, thing. yeah, you're, you're right. I'm going to be too greedy and then we'll lose everything and then she fox will feel sad. Is there a reaver around? No. Wow, you're right. But with our luck, one will show up right at the last minute. Mm-hmm. Well, that's what happened last time we hit one of these vaults. Me and she fox were offloading and it was coming right for us and then they kind of just turned away. And I was like, no way. They kind of just lost interest. Was there that one time we were offloading and then the dude just came for us? Like, you know, we just started offloading stuff? Oh no, no, maybe that was another group. I think we sunk a boat that tried to do that. Yeah, but I think we got sunk after that. Well, I mean, you know. Once we offload all of our booty, anything can happen. We'll be fine.
Oh, Brad, for you turning left? All right. Yeah. I'm, I'm signaling. Incoming artillery. We are being fired upon. Torpedo in the water, torpedo in the water. You can uh, start raising sails, or at least half raise the front sail. How about raising canes? What is that? Chicken. No. I think we've talked about this before. Yeah. It reminds me of another thing I think we talk about all the time, Bradford. What's that? Well, that would be the difference between a corn dog and a pronto oh puppy. Oh my god. You see, Bradford, a corn <laughs> I, dog. Dude, 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 dude. No. A corn no, dog, Brad. No, 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 no. I, I know. I understand. What do you understand, Bradford? That a corn dog. No. <laughs> yes. No. I want to know. Oh. No. Well, Bradford will gr gladly tell you. No. I and, if he, not. and if he does, and if he remembers, then maybe I'll back off a little. It's not, but you could try. Dude, you said it to me like, like ten times at at the fair. <laughs> like what did I say? What did I say? You don't even remember. I said it to you ten <laughs> times. You don't. You don't remember. You remember how many times I said it, but not what I said. Or maybe I'm purposely, purposely being silent. No, you're not. Yes, I am. Bradford, what is a corn dog made of? Corn flour. What's what's a, don't don't you leave this boat? Don't you, Bradford? You get your ass back on this boat. <laughs> I left the boat. All right, that's it. I'm dropping anchor. I don't even need to. Oh, I, we're still kind of moving. We put the sails up. Did we? Yeah. yeah. The sails are up. You don't have to put anchor. Now we're wait, still wait, moving. I can actually, I can actually wait this. Oh, that's cool. Gonford. Oh, there's a ship over there. Player? Hello. Uh, yeah. Looks like it. I can't climb. Uh, I can't jump anymore. Why? Oh, now I can. That was weird. Get away from me. Uh, whatever you are. <coughs> there's snakes on this island. Okay. I don't want to die, so you guys can chill over there and not come anywhere near me. Okay, I guess you're gonna ignore what I just said. Hello. <laughs> Cornford. No. Oh. Well, whenever I talk about Pronto Pup, Branford, Br Bramford finds it to be quite c cornfording. Got him. Thanks. You're welcome, dude. And anytime. That you feel lost and you need to know the difference between a corn dog and a pronto, but like just call I me. I promise you, I do. I will not. Oh, you might. And when that time comes, I'll be there for you. <laughs> I'm trying not to die. Sometimes you feel like having a corn put. So this is where the treasure is. Oh boy, nope. What is it? Nothing. That was clench. I 
actually found it, but there's a bunch of skeletons next to me. And a giant annoying monster that has killed all of them for me. Cool. I'll push to you. Ow. Definitely not worth, uh... What was that? Are you trying to burn a crab? Can't find She Fox on Discord, so we'll post the link. Oh, chat, be nice. She'll add you. Found some curse. Better be dead. Curse ball. Siren gen. All right. Bradford is the tomb on the ground. Uh, no, it's not on. It's probably not on the island. It's in the uh, keys in this chest. Oh, we're looking for the key. That's right. And oh. And of course, it's on the. Everything respawned. Get away. Get out of here. There's loot up here. You may need help with back. Okay. Ow. All right, on the way. I thought we were done, but I, I'm I'm coming. <clears throat> I'm gonna be right back. Gonna go get some ammo. The ammo box is here in the in the tower. If you need it. Hello. Monsters of monsterness. How'd you get up there, Brad? Uh, you have to take the long way up. <laughs> okay, I see it. Coming back. Yeah. Sleepy chat, I need a nap. I'm here. I just need to go dig the chest up. There might be more space for the other items that are over here. Yeah, Cornford and his pet cor corn dog. <sighs> or would you One name him down? the Pronto Pup? No. Because you see, Bradford, one is a dog, and the other is wheat-based. <laughs> Coming back to you. Give me a second. Oh. Sir? Now have shields. Cheeks clapped. Oh, another one. Nice. Dude, there's so many of these guys. I have the chest. Mm. Let's go. Run, Bradford! Uh, go down the path. Down there. Oh, uh, we're getting run up on by people. Are we? Yeah. Okay, we gotta go. Get back to the ship right away. Jump! Or that's a skeleton ship, which might actually be a skeleton ship. We gotta go, we gotta go. Gotta get back to the ship. She Fox, you coming? Yeah. That's a skeleton galleon. What? That's behind you. Skeleton galleon. Are you coming? It's not a player ship. Me? Yahar? Yahar? Yahar. There was a Her? siren gem up there somewhere, Her? but Her? I left it. Her? I have the key in this chest. What for? That's a skeleton. Game. Yeah, it is. Yep. A player. Yep. Yeah. It scared me for a second. I was just like, oh. Galleon down there next to ours. Did I get some snow today? Oh! I did, yep. What? I think they made uh, the mermaid dudes have like the staffs. I think they made those guys weaker. I think they nerfed them so they're not as annoying to kill if they show up near your ship. Come on, let me put it in the. Can I put this in the chest, please. 
toga esquerda. Uh, devil fish. That's where we need to get. Right, I'm on board. What the hell? Okay. Brother, yeah. You like uh, the rifle, she fox? Of course I do. Mm, are we going back on the island or mm, ripping away? I think we're going to rip out. So now that we're like a level 5 ship, we're basically like pinged on the map for everybody else, so we should probably just... Okay. Wait. There's something shining on we, the beach. At... Yeah, it's a trident thing. Yeah. We should try to find this map. Where was it? Let me check that again. Summer was last week, exactly, yeah. This whispering skull is too loud. You need to whisper quietly over here, sir. Thank you. Very distracting. Alright, Bradford, where are we going? South. Wait for me. I have a box here. Oh? What's in the box? What's in the box? You can check in in a second. Fireworks? Yeah. We could fill those up now. Devil's Ridge, we go. like the intro music but that was it <coughs> what's up goofy lord kitty oh rock Frozen rain. Are we going home? No, we're gonna go to um, 
put a key into the thing to open the door. Oh. And then we gotta do that thing where we get all the loot outside the door before it closes. There's oh, also okay. three tokens that we can find around and we can plug into a thing to get extra loot and booty. Extra booty. There are two ships in front of us. I am turning us to the left. San Francisco treat. Shit. Okay. Wow, that was okay. We're good. <laughs> uh, who's driving the boat? All three of us are up here. Uh, no one. Oh, great. Jesus, take the helm. People want PvP, I think. Uh, I don't. Yeah, me neither. Uh, where is the wind going? Going. Okay, we, we better get down. We're gonna be fighting soon. We need to make sure we turn these sails appropriately. Uh, turn our sails to the left. All right, sails port side. Catch the wind. They might just be. A ship ahead to the whole left. They have their sails not properly aligned either, so. Oh, maybe they're not. Maybe they were actually just going to this island. So, our current heading south. Standing by. Port side uh, cannons. It don't don't fire on them. We don't have to. Standing by. The ship was on the left, right? There was a yep. ship on the left? Yeah, you, there was. It's just... there. No, it's in the fog. Uh yeah, it is. I lost them. We will uh, turn right. There's a fort up ahead of us. <coughs> I do not see them anywhere. Are you are you in the crow's nest? Yeah. Is it counting crows? Do they take requests? Back to the south. Oh, the south was sort of where that dude was at, so I'm like trying to avoid it. At least head a southwest.
Standing by. Alright, where's the... Mm -mm. What are we looking for, Bradford? Oh yeah, they were just going to that island next to us. Okay. <laughs> Uh, now the one in the fog, I don't know where he's going. Oh, we're still going to Devil's Ridge, we're trying to get to the vault. A firm, Raj. Then, uh, unload. Yep. And everything new, looks so nice in here. Not new, you can't see the, Isn't it pretty? The ship's yeah. on the horizon. It's like me looking in the mirror. So lucky. I know. Hey, don't hate me because I'm beautiful. Mermaid Vault dead ahead, yeah. True, chat, true. Chad, thanks for all the likes. It's awfully nice of you. To you folks who smash that like button, you're more likely to be gifted memberships and stuff if a member bomb happens to blow up in the chat. So, ones in the chat to be active in the chat for YouTube's membership gifting. And smash that like button. Yahar. 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 Toss a one to your streamer. Yahar. Hey, look, another ship. Hello! Right over there. Where are they at, Bradford? Behind us. Bum 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 Dark out. A little too dark for my liking. Yeah, Bradford's all glowy, I know. Fits his uh, his laugh. Yeah, your little outfit. You look like a <laughs> you look like a like a fire ember.
Looks cool. Yeah, it's pretty cool. We got a skeleton ship in front of us. Starboard side. We do. We do. At about our one o'clock. Welcome gone home as an intern. Bradford, are you going for a fight here? No. Oh, okay. Uh, I'm just moving us uh, to the right. To the right a little bit. I should actually be moving us to the left. But I just wanted to avoid the silence. I think rock outcropping. The island doesn't like us. Uh oh. Don't mm -hmm. don't shoot her. Don't shoot the Meg. We'll probably die. Gonna hit the ship. Mm-hmm. Crisis averted. Hello. Hello. Oh, Hello. hi, Avers. Yo. Figure if you guys sell, do you want to take a galleon out? Okay. We have to hit the vault first, and then we can go sell. And then if you want to do one run in the galleon, we can do that. Yeah, yeah. She Fox, that okay? Uh. Oh, you want bedtime Yeah, I soon. think so. Yeah, I'm yeah. just a bit tired. No, no, you can, you can have bedtime. No. You make the call. We'll hit this. I'm just gonna... We'll I'm just gonna finish this one with you. Yeah, yeah. That's okay. After we, um, after we sell, then you make the call. Okay. Who should call? Ghostbusters! If you want a corn dog, but you want a pound of pup, but you don't know the difference, who are you gonna call? JG Wentworth! Hello, I'm JG Wentworth. The difference between a corn dog and a pronto pup is that a corn dog is corn based with corn starch and or corn flour, as where a pronto pup is a wheat based batter and it's good with mustard right Bradford and only mustard. ketchup oh no. my god no oh no. my god no no see see chat see this is what I had to deal with here see hold on hold on I'll, I'll, I'll steal man you I prefer ketchup too it's it's my <laughs> but it's my live stream I and my I want sanity that, now you told me I was a wuss well no no bag you like ketchup too, Uthris? What the hell? The Japan Ke Japanese ketchup would be ideal. angered with you. You'd be oh, angered. No. By the way, I found out what we're calling our next trip. I mean, I had sushi last night. So. Pals in Nippon together. Pals in Nippon? On onward. That's an acronym. Banzai. Banzai. Take the first letter of each of those words. Pals in Nippon together onward. Uh-huh. <laughs> it ain't gonna be there. <laughs> it's gonna be you, me, and Uth it's gonna be you, well, me, and Uth. Name it that. He's, we're, we, he's gonna just like uh, send I, you a, a, a text randomly. He's like, "Hey, where are you guys at?" I have complained about him for years, honestly. But I, I, honestly, all the other times I was kind of just joking. But I am kind of insulted. 
by how much insulted by the first class. Well, the whole like, like not visiting against. anybody, you know, like he swings no. by Netherlands, no time for Elmox, you know, three, four, seven times, you know. Well, Elmox is a busy, busy man. No. Sorry, I may have scratched the paint. I may have leaking water. I'm on it. Nice, we may have leak, hostiles eh? on the shoreline, and there's a keg on the shoreline, which is kind of scary. Keg? Are you guys going to a bar? Hell yeah, brother. What? I would say we are taking on water. We are. Oh, I have to hold it. I didn't know that. I thought it was auto. Uh, is that it? Do we have a leak still? Hold on, I need to check something real quick. He's, that cannon dude's firing at something. Was he firing at Meg? He's firing at Meg! <laughs> Alright. Uh, I'm gonna pick this keg up and destroy it someplace away from the ship. Or you can do that. Oh no, this guy this guy's got a gun. See you in hell, bitch! What you looking for? We're looking for the vault entrance. Here. Might actually be over there. Okay, go into the water. I'm out of ammo. Someone else have to shoot. I got it. Oh, there's that. And we'll be right back in just a moment. Chief Fox, you ready? Yeah. Are you standing by? Where are Yahar. you? Yahar. Oh, Yahar, okay. Here. Yahar. Alright, we're standing by. Uthris, I thought you'd be practicing for the big moment, the big strand. I already got to level 3 bard. So. Ooh! How many runs? One? Uh, I escaped like four times. Oh, really? Yeah, goblin caves, though. Not, not oh, yeah, okay. How, how are the goblin caves? Oh, easy. As a bard, I just use my high charisma score and talk people to be friendly, and then I steal the portal and I leave. So, uh, it's pretty good. Bomba. Hello. Uh, wait, waiting on you, Buford. Are you got... Oh, wait, I need to go, go grab the key. What? Oh my god. I thought you had it on you, otherwise I would have ran and got it. Oh my god. It was inside of a chest that I hid in the ship. Alright, She Fox. We're gonna get on this door and we're gonna get ready to go. You remember what happened last time, right? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. All you have to do is pick the treasure up and set Tuck. it outside the, the door. Go. Uh, I do have to raise our anchor first, though, just in case we get PvP'd.
pain in the ass. What? Just being a dupa. Piggies! Boom, 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 boom. Oh, Brad. Bradford just stealing the boop? No, he's pulling the whip up. Oh, okay. Gotta love stealing the whip. Plus, we were kind of parking in a, a red zone just for loading. Do a barrel roll. Only. Man, this game's pretty, dude. What's she fox chewing on? Well, she's got her VOIP on in game, so whenever she talks, her mouth moves like she's chewing gum. It's funny. Where'd she go? Okay, Bradford, that's going to do it there, pal. Ah, uh, if you wouldn't if you would have stopped a little earlier, We could have used the uh, harpoons. There's the... I just want to make sure this is going to stop. I didn't... The wrong one up. This one up, right? Yeah, okay, cool. I can always turn it. I just wanted it so we can easily run out to the boat. I know. Standing by! You guys ready? Standing yeah. by! Okay, uh, it's on. It's gone. Get ready to run. Alright, everything outside the door. Standing by. Starting from the chest, right? Right? Yeah, just set everything outside of this door. Here. Yeah, start with the chest. Go. All the items. Or any anything that's just not gold, I guess. I'm gonna set everything that's up on an upper level on the floor. Yep. Are the tokens usually under like piles? What do you mean? You know, the tokens that we can put into the thing in the middle. Uh, sometimes. I've never. I've only ever actually gotten that once. Let's see if the tokens are here. I've placed one. Okay, cool. Actually, might be one down there. This is exciting. There's a lot of money to be made. How much time we got, Brad? They just watch the door. Uh, I think I saw. Got about a good 30 seconds. Nah, really? At most. Keep grabbing items then. I found a medallion. Uh, a medallion here. Good. Hey, hey, hey. Got Come it. Here. Put yep. it down. Yep, Drop got it. Up. I got it. Okay, two, two of three. Two of three? Two of three, mm -hmm. yeah. We need one more. One more. Oh, I see the last one, I think. Get it, Bradford. Actually, that's a chest. Never mind. Actually, that one? Shoot. 
fell down. Okay, keep grabbing items and running them out. Or, or keep grabbing gold on the floor or something. Run over to this side. Oh, that's it, that's it, that's it. We gotta go. I mean, I'll die in here. Okay. I think, I think I just fill some water. Bye. Yep. See if you can find the last token. Mm -hmm. Uh, probably not gonna. We're probably gonna drown first. Damn it. Maybe. There's so much stuff in there, man. Hey, good. Hey, doggo. Hey, Arco. Thank you very much for the See little. It anywhere? No. Yeah. yeah. Raptor you found, you found it? Yeah. Can you grab it? And... Oh. Well, there. Yeah. oh, I got it. Oh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. See if we can get out of here. Oh, did it open the door? No. We actually did. We actually got it, though. <laughs> nice work. I pushed the thing. Yeah, it didn't work. It's already locked. Ugh, big sad. Oh, we did pretty good. New member, welcome. How much did we get out? Quite a bit. Look like 20 chests or so. So this is a lot. We got a lot of stuff. <laughs> hmm. Oh, you're right. We could turn the boat so we can do the grappling. Is that what you're going to say? Uh, doing it already. Oh, nice. Okay. I'll put it over uh -huh. here. I don't know if I'll be able to reach, but we'll see. Go down. If you can lure the big guy to the right, I have a can. Everybody's still alive. He's dead. <laughs> oh, that's so fast. I know, it's like an auto-loader now. It's way better. Mm -hmm. It's way better. Way better. I can't believe they didn't make that change when they did the Sovereign stuff. You're glad to be a little Raptor? Well, thanks, dude. To the uh, the Devil's Roar Raptor. Mm, I think so. Uh, Agent Spire's close by. We could sell to the north. Yeah. If there's a player, we can go out to the Devil's Roar and sell it there. But it might be a little dangerous. But we'll have we'll have some fun with it.
Are you putting things below deck, Bradford? Nope. Okay. I mean, if the selling place is right next to us, I'm just not doing it. Uh, yep. Yay, thank you, Bradford. Alright, we gotta turn around to the north. Every now so. and then. Okay, cool. This is good. We got a vault and a sea fortress under our belt. That's big money. That's like big money when you shot Menards money. That's a lot. That's a lot of money, Bradford. That's at least one dollar. What's Menards? Yeah, it's like a Home Depot. Oh. It's just Midwest. and we'll do some of these uh, skeleton ships. Oh, okay. Engage a skeleton ship or two. Have some fun with it. Alright, let's go sell. Yeah, money! Bradford, what's the biggest uh, amount you've made in one run in the game? Uh, I, I actually don't know. A lot. I actually don't even know how much I currently have. Yeah. I'd say probably like 100k or something. Alright, chat. Right now I have eight hundred and seventy two thousand five hundred and I think it's sixty eight bucks in the game. So how much do you think we're going to uh, earn from this run? Remember it's a vault. We pretty much like ninety percent of the vault and like a hundred percent of the sea fort. What do you guys think? How much do you think we'll make or what do you think my money will be at when we're done? You want to raise sales? Uh, raise that one to uh, half. Alright. One dollar, Bob. Actually, the gold guy is right there. Uh, raise it to, like, full. R raise it to full? Yeah, or just raise it up all the way. The gold guy is right here on the left. I might as well just run it ashore. Oh, okay. We'll just have to repair it. Drop the anchor now. Alright, dropping anchor. We're we'll running shorter, but. Oh. Or, maybe, or maybe not. No damage. Wait, I, I can just drop it off the. Oh no. Yeah, don't just drop it because the ship can run it over. I can just drop stuff in the water. Right? Yeah, but if the ship runs it over, I think it'll, I think it'll break it. Oh. Name emissary quest. Oh, it's an emissary quest. Oh, that's a lot of quests. I'm not doing that. Screw that. Nice. I'll just drop them overboard. You guys can swim back from. Sound good? Or or you can drop the floorboard and hit us with a harpoon. What? 
we can drop him overboard and then hit us with a harpoon. Oh, okay. There's still stuff on the boat too. And the hold. Or you can start running the gold or the stuff from the hold up there. Oh baby, we're making big money. Did we? Yeah. yeah. Oh, okay. Some of those items might have to be sold to the lady on the dock. Uh, the... Uh, I want the... I want the chest. I can start carrying more. Yeah, we're getting close. Oh, can I have that? I think I'm gonna make a million. Oh yeah.
What's your plan for the small step, Brad? For you just want to load it into a box? Yeah, that's what I'm doing. I'm loading it into boxes. Okay. Uh, be careful putting all the stuff overboard because it can despawn in the water. Really? Yeah. Okay. You can sink and it'll, and it'll despawn. That's annoying. I'll bring it ashore. Second million, the first million with subscribers is true. Wait, do these ghost chests go to the gold hoarder? Uh, the chests do. The ones that look like they're little wrapped boxes go to the lady on the dock. Yo, Chubbs, welcome aboard as a raptor egg, dude. It's booty night here on the channel. Nice. New member, welcome. Green eyes in the chat, show them some love. Membership yet again. Almost done. Oh, the Reaper's hideout. Oh, one of these requires the Reaper. Oh. What is it? Um, it's just a crate, supply crate. What? This kind? one here. Uh, rag and bone. box I don't need this oh, okay let's drop it off to the side oh, are you trying to set up a renewal for membership oh it's like not uh, I think I thought YouTube had this thing where you could like pre-buy memberships for like multiple months if you wanted I thought there was something where if you hit join you could like choose to be a member for like a year or six months or whatever I mean if you're down to support the channel for a year, that's awesome. At least you you can do that without having to worry about annoying PayPal or credit cards or whatever. I've had that happen before where you you know you buy something or try to get a something for multiple months and then it doesn't work. Annoying. Uh we just got the small stuff now, right? You are? Uh yeah, there's uh -huh. still some stuff on the boat. Oh, you there's don't like want this? A, there's like a uh, mermaid gem on the deck. I don't know what else is uh, still in there. Uh, if there's any more small stuff, there is a uh, treasure chest still on the door. We also get money when we turn in our flag, right? Uh, when we lower emissary, yeah. Yeah. 
Yo, Daniel, thanks for the 17 months. Did you hear Jerry? No, that was who it was. Uh, Hi, my name is Jerry. Else down here. Actually, there is a tre uh, treasure chest down here that needs to be taken. Jareth Riss. Uh, <clears throat> I'm moving with this. Okay, there's a treasure chest right here. Oh, I'm standing on it. Mm -hmm. Uh, then the resource chests that are specific to a resource can be filled up with sold, like a cannonball chest or something. I don't know if a supply chest can be sold. Hi, ma'am. Oh, there's stuff in that. Oh baby, we're approaching one million dollars. There could only be one Jerry, yeah, and he's probably napping right now. In a ball crate. I got a uh, chest here for small stuff. I think all the small stuff's been taken. Is it? E mm -hmm. Yes. Um, I would. Yahar. Sell our supply crates, this treasure chest we still have. Um, the opulent curio. I'm saying storage crates. Yeah, any of the storage or supply crates, you can sell them to the lady on the dock. Uh, if they're a specific item crate, like a fireworks crate or a cannonball crate, they have to be full. We have a fireworks box, but it's not full. Uh, check to see that cannonball crate. There's still some fireworks in it. Or one of them. Unless oh, you yeah. emptied it. Uh, no, it got emptied into the fire fireworks crate. Never mind. Uh, this, so that can't be turned in. This treasure chest can be turned in. Oh, God, your dog just peed on the deck. Oh, well. Probably cleaner than it was. sell these back. Okay, we're all unloaded. How much money do you have now, Sheep Fox? Hmm? hmm? 257? Wow. That's a big haul. I mean, you know. Oh, we we no, oh, we have to lower our emissary. We're too close to our right next here. stream. Yeah, we're, we're kind of close. Come here, come here, Rap. We have to lower our emissary. Can't do anything with nine minutes. What? Come here, you have to lower the, lower the, lower the flag. Yeah. Well, where's here? Oh, there. Yeah. Well, don't you lower the... F okay. No, you have to actually uh, remove the emissary to get the... Bonus money! Yeah. And there we go. Holy hell! Five thousand dollars. Wow. Good job. All right, is there nothing What's else at all on the boat? Let's see. I'm just going to do one last check. Good work. All the good stuff's been out. All right, cool. Nice work. Yahar. 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 Good night, Chief Fox. Good night. Bye. Thank you all. Bye. Thank you. Good night. And congratulations on 200 and something thousand, let's say 75. Awesome. 
Bradford, we can't uh, sell supply crates, can we? Nah, I tried. Yeah, me too. Okay. Alright, then. That'll do it. Alright, Uthris, are you ready for D&D? &D? Roll for initiative. Roll for what now? <laughs> roll for initiative? Yeah, roll for initiative. Roll a d20, come on. Dude, I'm a d20 roller. That was my my gang in high school, bro. I was a d20 roller. Oh, I thought that was roller. your stripper name. No, my stripper name was Succulent. That's a good one. That's but good one. people thought that that meant I just needed low light and minimal water. Which, one of those is true. As a gamer. I'll let you guess which one's chat. <laughs> Bradford, are you going to play Dark and Darker? Come on, it's like the year 2007. You know, to yeah, use bro, we're, we're, we're using a torrent to play this game that looks like something that's kind of Skyrim, but like even earlier. It do, It really does remind me like a first-person Diablo, kind of, in a way. Yeah, it makes me think Neverwinter. Yeah, like there you siege. go. Yeah, the, uh, was that the type where you would like hit forward or left and you would just like go in the cardinal directions? Um, no, those would be like the top-down, very... Almost like a, a very D and D inspired top down RPGs. Yeah, yeah, it's like Quake. Hexen. Yeah. Oh, there you go. It's like Hexen. Yeah, it's actually yeah. I would say Hexen, but multiplayer. There you go. That's what this is. There you go, man. Brought you lunch. Nailed it. Cool. All right, chat, we're going to be back in about five minutes for our next stream, so let the party continue. If you like hanging out in the chat, make sure you smash the like button. Thank you very much for subscribing. Big shout-out to She Fox for joining us for her second and, like, 100% still successful uh, both Vault Raids and also the uh, Fortress Raid. Exclamation point Bradford in the chat, too. And exclamation point Uthris to watch him as we play Dark and Darker in a bit. And then, uh, I guess, Bradford, what are you going to do? Just chill? You can just chill with us if you want. Or whatever yeah, you're gonna maybe. do. Yeah. Or are you gonna I keep? Are you gonna keep soloing or something? I'm. I'm definitely not soloing. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> That's cool. Feel welcome to hang. Uh, yeah. So we'll be back in a couple minutes. I'm gonna take a break, and then I'll see you guys as we continue our streams for today. And happy Sunday, chat. Very good. Very proud of everybody. We did great in Sea of Thieves. I'm glad She Fox joined us, and that it wasn't a fiasco. Star Citizen. Okay. Anyway, I'll see you guys in uh, just a minute or two. Good job, Buford. Thanks for leading the ship. All right.